Guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you're not subscribed, definitely hit that subscribe button. If you're new, welcome. So today's video is going to be a quick tutorial on how to use this Afro Puff ponytail that I purchased from Amazon. So as you can see right now, I'm blow drying my hair out. I have my Cantu Thermal Shield Protectant Spray. I've oiled and greased my hair. And so I'm just going through the process of blow drying it out. And this is just going to allow me to stretch my hair past its natural curly kinky state so I can put it in a ponytail. Moving on, now that I have blow dried my hair out, now it should be long enough to fit into a ponytail decently. And so now I'm just going to go about that process of putting it into a ponytail. And I first came across this idea because I did it on my daughter. And I was like, why can't I do that? Yeah, this should be easy. And this is a really affordable, quick and easy hairstyle to do, guys. So first I'm going to start with my, I have my um, hair ties. Uh, hard brush what else do I got guys I have the Afro Puff yay this was like I said it's $12 off of Amazon it's like it had, comes with the drawstring it has the combs one on each side to tack down onto your hair I'm also going to be using bobby pins as well to double secure the ponytail to my hair so yeah, it's like a little netted drawstring ponytail, and it's kinky curly, and uh, color 1B. <laughs> um, so I'm using the Lotta Body um, Edge Control from Walmart, I think it was like $3.50, and the Cantu for Natural Hair Coconut Oil Shine and Hold Mist for the ponytail that I have. So uh, let's get started. When I tell y'all the struggle, okay, with the back of my head. So I got this spritz spray, um, holding spritz that I'm going to spray on to hold my hair down. I need something a little stronger than that can too. So I'm going to use this. And I love this stuff. It makes your hair shiny. And it's not too hard. It doesn't make your hair super hard, like got to be glued. So it's that perfect in between. So y'all, the back of my head like come on now come together please lord it just does not want to get up there yeah i don't know it's gonna i'm gonna get it i'm going to get it to as close as possible <laughs> so yep Okay 
guys, so I'm going to wrap my hair to hold it down and so it will stay in place with all the spritz that I put on and it will also help me lay down that little back piece in the back. And hopefully you won't be able to see it anyway because it will be underneath the ponytail. So that will hide that little area right there too. So I have my ponytail, I'm using my Cantu for natural hair coconut oil shine and hold mist on the actual ponytail. Yes, this is synthetic hair, but I feel like it adds a little bit of extra shine and um, just to, to add a little moisture to the hair so it won't look so dry either. So I am uh, just kind of prepping the ponytail a little bit. So, you know, using the drawstring for how small I want it and then uh, I also want to show you guys the netted part on the inside and that's pretty much it y'all this ponytail is so fire like I'm in love with this thing So as I'm placing the ponytail over my natural hair ponytail, you know, I'm just going to readjust it and get it to where I really want it to be. I'm going to do the drawstring in the front. It doesn't really matter because it's easier for me to pull and see how small I want it by looking at it in the front. And as you can see, the placement of it is perfect. Just going to wrap that drawstring around really quick. Um, wrap the hair around really quick to make it look a little bit more natural like it's coming from my hair you know and make it a little smaller using my bobby pins like I said earlier to um, add extra stabilization to the ponytail and you guys I haven't even done my baby hair yet and it is fire
Okay guys, I'm back, finished my edges, and uh, we're about to take this off and see the final result. And I'm uh, loving it. Yes, sis, yes. Work it. <laughs> um, so, I love this, okay? It's everything. So that's all for this video, you guys. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Definitely hit that subscribe button, the bell for notifications for when I post new videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one.